There you go. That's speed one, take one. So guys, the wait is over. George the Poet is happy to be a part of this campaign and we can't wait to work with you guys. Oh, amazing. Hey, thanks. That's amazing. <laughs> Thank amazing. you, Sandra. Yes. Well, I'm, I'm waiting for George the Poet to turn up. So we're getting prepared for our Earth Day and for ecology, that's like Christmas for us where everyone's thinking about the climate. And George has said he would help us out on our campaign. We're going to be working together on producing just a beautiful spoken word piece. So really exciting. It's all going to be about nature and just looking forward to meeting the guy. Hi, George. And thank you so much for making time. Not at all, man. The, the, the pleasure's all mine. <laughs> it's good. Uh, what are you up to at the moment? Um, writing, writing like a madman and, um, uh, <laughs> you know, just trying, looking for new inspiration and, and, and this, this falls in that category, what we're here to discuss. I am the storyteller. I can, I can do that side of it, but the people who are committing their lives and their productive hours to generating new ideas, coming up with solutions that can meet people's current lifestyles. I want to meet those people. I want to champion and promote those people. To have this conversation and to see the passion in your eyes and to see what you've done, that now sits in my system. So I let that marinate for a bit and start pulling out words and phrases. And that's something that I'm looking forward to. Very nice. Arriving. What an amazing fit this is all looking to be. Yeah, thank you. Thank you very much, man. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm very grateful that you guys considered me for this. Um, so it, it's good work that you do. So uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's have fun with it. Um, and that wants to be called Custard. So we organised a briefing session with George the Poet and Elliot at the tail end of last week. And George is actually coming back uh, with the words that he has created over the weekend today. Um, having somebody like George uh, create this gives me a lot of confidence that this campaign is going to have serious impact. Uh, so we're going to get the ecology guys online and give it a listen this afternoon. And sow seeds of hope for those next in line. Sick. Awesome. Oh, no, so it is. <laughs> <laughs> So seven days planning from idea to securing George the Poet to us being on location. Full and viral team is here, full camera crew here, ecology team has just arrived and we've got George the Poet coming in 10 minutes time. It's spring, the sun is out, really gorgeous and uh, yeah, we'll see what happens into the forest we go. When you meet George, it's just like, oh, this just feels real. You know, in a world where things can be kind of charaded and filtered and everything, you know, I think what an amazing lens that George brings to what we can do. Scene one, take nine. And access! So 14 days ago we came to Ecology with the idea, 7 days ago we signed George the Poet, moved super fast on that, we just delivered and wrapped the, uh, the shoot day, couldn't have gone better. I know it's going to be good, I know it's going to be good, I, you know from the moment I heard it I thought this is just such a sweet overlap of like passion and talent and people are going to be happy to hear this and then I hope uh, really inspired and connected for sure. Now it's time for the edit and uh, we're going to have a real quick turnaround because it's going to be released in one week's time. In a hundred years, all they're going to know about us is the world that we left behind. <laughs>